the SoFi Hawaii Bowl. I hope I said that name right. Yeah, you did. So that's that's what the new stadium is going to be in uh, Inglewood, right? Yeah. So for the Rams and whatever else. The SoFi Hawaii Bowl, 7 p.m. ESPN on Christmas Eve. It's from Honolulu, Hawaii, which gets us back to, to the Hawaii Bowl on Christmas Eve. Thank the Lord, because that was like a tradition at my place. Like, Was it the same with you? No. no yeah, you, never, you didn't have the game on in the background? I don't, I don't have a lot of say on Christmas time. I can understand it. I can understand it. But now, at Christmas Eve, we spend at my parents' house. Well, yeah. And, a, and my dad has a, all the say on the TV. So you have a point. father. Uh, that's a good point. That kind of changes things. I don't have that. Kind of changes things. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't are, have a man that gets to make any decisions in my life. You are welcome at my family Christmas if you would like to come over and watch the ball game. I'm going to be busy. <laughs> I'm going to be a little busy, but that's fine. Uh, Kalani Sataki and his BYU Cougars visit Nick Rolovich and the Hawaii Warriors. Now, Rolovich has been a lot of fun this year. They're 9-5. Yes. and five. Uh, They won their division of the Mountain West. BYU, 7-5. and five. They had to fight through some injuries and whatnot. That's right. Lost the last game of the year against San Diego State. Only put up three points against San Diego State. Yeah, uh, San Diego State's defense is good. Three points is kind of an embarrassment. Though. A little bit. Uh, BYU, 0-4 against the spread of their last four. Yeah. Did not look good. But I will say this. Both of these teams, 1-3. In unders, like they so one over three unders in their last four games, uh, that was kind of surprising to me from Hawaii. Uh, people kind of figured out well, their defense. I mean, their offense. Their excuse offense. me. Yeah, really well coached teams did. Yeah, I don't know the. You think BYU is that? I think BYU is pretty well coached. Okay, I think this is a pretty good football team. Okay, I don't think I don't I don't think well coached teams score three points. But okay. the the line is. Two, yep. BYU favored by two. It opened as a pick 'em. Um, the opening line opened up sixty three for the total. It is now at sixty four. Now, obviously, Hawaii's offensive numbers way way up there. Number twelve in yards per play. Number one hundred seven in defensive yards per play. That's right. Um, BYU a little more middle of the road. Number thirty nine in, in yards per play. Not number fifty six. But not terrible either. Exactly. Yeah. Um. I will say this. Cole McDonald, in his last six games, only had six touchdown passes. Three of those were against Army. I was just about to say, he, he played some better competition at the end of the year defensively, though. Yeah, San Diego State, uh, yeah, Boise, Boise State. Yeah. yeah. Like, it's not like he was playing slubs. Agreed. Nobody scored a lot against San Diego State. Agreed. In the Mountain West, nobody scored a lot against Boise State. No, that's true. That's true. Um. However, one thing that Cole does like to do is throw interceptions. Oh, yeah. Oh, BYU, he's he's going to let it rip. BYU is number eight in the country with that's 15 interceptions. Uh, BYU has beaten Hawaii the last two seasons by 10-plus points each time. Doesn't matter if it's on the island. No, they get a lot of home. guys from the island. They're, they're very comfortable playing there. Oh, yeah. They, uh, I mean, they recruit there. They are a significantly more physical team than Hawaii. Yes, I like BYU here totally minus two. styles of football. I, I'm, I like the under 64. I like BYU minus two here. I think they dominate this game physically. I think wow. they keep the football away from Hawaii. I'm going with my boy. you going Rolovich, huh? Oh, Rolovich, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. He's on the island. He's At home just, on Christmas he's Eve. He's just going to be looking cool. He's going to have sunglasses on. He's just, yeah. You rolling over or under? Ooh, oh, God. I'll go over. I think BYU's still going to score. I mean, obviously Hawaii is not gonna not gonna shut anybody out. No, no, not at all. I want a high scoring game. No, that makes sense. Fun. That makes sense. And yeah, you're right. They're gonna the ball won't hit the ground a lot when Hawaii's on offense. No, you are right about Somebody's that. Nobody's catching it. You are <laughs> right about that. 